Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are doing extremely fine. My name is Prince and you are watching the Tech Stream. In this video, we are going to have a quick look on the official Color OS 12 for the OnePlus 8 series devices. So without wasting any more time, let's get started. So OnePlus recently released their official version of Color OS 12 for the OnePlus 8 series devices. If you go into the about info section, you can see that the build number is C.17 on my OnePlus 8T. And on OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro, the build number version will be C.13. Also, you can see that the Android security patch is still 5th Feb 2022 and the March security patch has still not been released. I am not going to show you how to install this Color OS 12 as I have already made 3 videos on this topic and you can follow any of those videos. Link to all those videos and download file will be in the description below. Comment down if you face some problem while installing Color OS 12, I will be more than happy to help. Coming to the official build, it is very smooth and solid and it just flies through everything that you can throw. I have not faced a single instance where the ROM lagged in my 2 days of usage. It is honestly so much better than Oxygen OS 12 in terms of performance and stability and even battery. And as you can see, I have de bloated all the Chinese apps on my phone, so the performance has been uplifted even more. Comment down if you want me to make a video on how to remove all these Chinese crap and bloatware from Color OS 12. Moving on to the change logs of this build, there are not any major changes because Color OS 12 was already very stable in the open beta builds. The first change log is that all the fingerprint related issues are fixed. I never faced any fingerprint related issue myself. But many users reported that the fingerprint icon used to flash even on the lock screen. So that has now been fixed. Another issue regarding the notification problems have also been fixed. But I still do face notification problems in Google Apps. It is not a major problem but it is still there. Now let's do some benchmarks to test the performance of this build. In Geekbench, the device scored 909 on single core and 3115 on multi core. However, when I switched to the high performance mode and ran the Geekbench test again, the device scored almost similar 908 in a single core and the multi core score went up to 3153. Now the question is, should you install this over Oxygen OS 12? And in my personal opinion, I do feel everyone should install Color OS 12 over Oxygen OS 12 because it is very smooth, stable and it just destroys Oxygen OS 12 in terms of features and stability and battery. The performance of this build is very promising honestly and I'm going to be on Color OS 12 for a while. So that was a quick look of the Color OS 12 on my OnePlus 8T. Comment down if you want a detailed review of this build. That's all for this video. Thank you for watching.